Good morning. This is Cajun Queen with your Divine Reading. Today is Thursday. <coughs> the first card I pull is the Nine of Swords. This is depression, worry. You may be having some regret. For the cat, this is about speaking your truth. Have strength, faith, and conviction in your voice. It has never been more needed. I pull the abundance card. This is natural prosperity, image and potential, and connecting with spirits. I pull the nine of cups. This is achievement, success, and success in search of something better. I pull the sloth. This is digital detox. Recalibrate, reset, and recharge. It's time to listen. Listen to the divine calling. Nature's symphony. Experience stillness. I put the Empress card. This is about abundance, fertility, and creation. I put the bear. It says, you are the light. It is safe to step fully into your light. Transform, divine help, allow change, and finding rainbows. Pull the death card. This is transformation, endings, big changes coming. Honeybee, divine feminine, you are being called on to rise. Exercise. Joyous movement. Choose your pace. Nourish your body. And I put Celestial Gatekeeper. And it says, clear your focus. Timing is critical. The eagle is considered a sacred animal in many cultures. Unafraid of confrontation, the resilience and unshakable confidence and courage that eagles demonstrate ensure their presence is felt. Their commanding and majestic presence, soaring high above the land below, demands your respect when you reside or walk within it. Flying in between realms of earth and spirit, these majestic animals are celestial gatekeepers, transform, transporting spiritual communication between the heavenly gateways. Eagles have always been closely associated with the God or spiritual higher power. The Aztecs, Sumerians, Romans, Egyptians, and Native Americans all viewed the eagle as a sacred bird that empowered the people below them. Many ancient modern cultures adopted the eagle as their spiritual icon. The freedom and wisdom these majestic birds represent are inspiring. Right now, you require a clear focus on what is ahead of you. Your timing is critical. While you have a sense of urgency, it is important not to rush. Think about the issue or circumstances carefully before you act. Ensure you have planned your forward process. All decision making needs to be carefully considered before you jump in prematurely. Make sure you have all the facts in front of you. <laughs> the affirmation, I resonate with my divine order. My soul is activated to the highest vibration. And I put Eye of Horus. The Eye of Horus brings divine perception, protection, and insight. You are gifted with certain spiritual abilities, including divine sight, that are awakening and growing now. You have much divine support and protection, so that you may grow your abilities and serve others with divine gifts. Trust your perception and know that you are divinely protected. And that is your reading for today. I am love. We are love. Thank you for watching.